Hey, Angie. Hello, hello, hello. Guys, when y'all come in, make sure you hit that thumbs up. We have Susan, Angie, Leanne, Diane, Paula. Hey, how are you? FD and Maureen. Awesome. Treasure Hustler sent you over. Yeah, I see she, they posted out of, um, on their community tab. Awesome. They will be here shortly. So how is everyone doing? I am doing good. Hey, Char, how are you? Awesome, good, I'm glad you got it. Hey, Mackenzie. So guys, I wanna open up this card first. Hey, Rhonda, hey, Diane. Guys, when y'all come in, make sure you hit the thumbs up for me, please. Um, we have the Treasure Hustlers coming tonight. Yes, Jackie and Sarah will be here. Hey, Patricia. A little warm. Yeah, it's the same here. Kind of warm and muggy. Hi, Felicia. So this card here is a thank you card that I got from OMG Andy's channel. It's from him and Danielle. And it says, Cynthia, thank you so much for the gifts. I absolutely love my shirt. We hung the wind chimes on our porch and both of us are munching on the chocolates. I sent them some chocolate, guys. And um, be, be on the lookout for a Nerf gun war on Andy's channel. I sent them both their own Nerf guns. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to them having a Nerf gun war. <laughs> Humid. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> so, I hope everyone is doing well. Hey, Valerie, how are you? I'm so excited to have them in here. Hopefully they got my email because um, I sent them the thing. If not, then they can come on and I'll do it. Whose channel is this? This is my channel, Diane. This is Diving with Friends. So this is my Friday live chat that I do. And um, tonight's guest is Treasure Hustlers. <laughs> which are here and um i'm so excited to have them on here guys because for one they truly helped out my channel when i first was starting hey susan how are you uh you're doing well um yes yeah he is on earth. well it's seven so he he's on normal time <laughs> popsicles are my yes they are so anyway, guys, I'm going to introduce my wonderful girls <laughs> and uh, y'all just show them some love. Uh, moderators, hey, Natural Way, how are you? While y'all in the chat, make sure that you, Angie, I know you're one of them in there. Please make sure that um, you're watching the chat and any kind of, you know, stuff going on, you know how to handle that. So I'm going to get these ladies in here. Jackie, we can't see you. Just move your head. There you go. Oh my goodness, this is a Jackie show. <laughs> hey, Sarah, how are you? Hi. How are y'all doing? Good. There's another setting that you can push it so we're like further back to make it like 
we're like, there you go. Oh, y'all like this any better. You didn't want to be close. I know we got to be six feet apart. <laughs> oh, y'all are violating. <laughs> All right. Dumpster diving girl, how are you? You new to the channel. Welcome, welcome. Guys, make sure that y'all are hitting the thumbs up on here. And um, so how's your day been? What's your shirt say? It says, please cancel my subscriptions to your issues. <laughs> that is cool. Yeah, I like this shirt. <laughs> Do you have that made or, or it's a shirt you bought? No, no, we just got it at yeah. one of the little stores around here. <laughs> oh, that is cool. She's not you. It's my shirt. Okay. You can share your shirt. No. <laughs> Look at her shirt. Show your boobs. Uh, what's your shirt say? It says oh, life. The cat. Hug life. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I am glad y'all on here, guys. Uh, can y'all hear me? Yeah. Am I clear on y'all in? Okay. Mm -hmm. I have this little microphone thing, but I never know if it's really picking up. Sounds good. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Well, like I was telling them, I'm so excited to have y'all on here, and uh, because y'all played a big part when I started my channel. I don't even know if y'all even know that, but mm -hmm. I remember. <laughs> you remember. Your birthday. It was your birthday. Yes. Yeah. yes, which is coming up next month. Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> Yes, yeah, so I definitely appreciate the birthday shout out. And when I made that wish, I did not know that I was going to have the hustle angels just. Uh -huh. <laughs> I remember that was yesterday. I think you were the first channel we ever shouted out. I think so too. That's how we'll remember it. Like you were the first channel we ever did that for. Like shout it out. I think it was your channel is the first one we ever did that for. That is amazing. Well, we did a video, an actual video for her for that. Yeah, oh, yeah. you did. Yeah. yeah, you actually did. I was just like, oh my gosh. I was, I was freaking out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'm going to, um, like I said, thank y'all for being here. Um, y'all are amazing, and I'm so glad to have y'all up in here. Hey, Grab It, how are you? Hey. Hey, Julie. Now, can y'all see the chat at all or just me? Yeah, we can see it. Oh, you can see it? Oh, yeah. I don't know about it that. <laughs> oh, trying, to, trying to get your attention. <laughs> I know. We're going to try not to look at it. but yeah. yeah, that's what I, you know, the other channels, I'm like, you don't have to worry about the chat. Just focus on, you know, just talking. Don't worry about that. <laughs> okay. So, questions. Um, how long um, have you had your channel? Go ahead. We always argue about this, so. Okay, well, we started a channel back, like, the end of 2017, but we didn't start diving until, like, January or February of 18, so just a little, like, two and a half years. Really? That's it? Mm -hmm. It got to be longer than that. Mm -mm. So y'all were, like, a fairly new channel because I've been on two years. Really? Yeah, we were... We were Right around your, you came like a little bit after us, but we were around YouTube like before we started the channel. Like, so we were like just chatting and chats and stuff, and we were like uploading like just random videos that had nothing to do with dumpster Old diving. Videos. Yeah, but we actually started dumpster diving. I think it was. She never knows, so we'll have to look into that, and I'll let you. Know. It was 2018. I know that. <laughs> so. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so uh, what was your what was the channel before? Nothing. We're still treasure hustlers. It was just Stephen Steph said, um, "What happened?" Steph said, "Well, why is, you should just put up whatever videos because we weren't putting up any videos." Mm -hmm. So then I uploaded like a video of me like at work, and she did one of like cake or what did you do? No, oh, that was my birthday where I got cake smashed in my face. Yeah, we just did like whatever videos. So so we looked like a real real people. <laughs> we just like, put yeah. like random videos up. <laughs> Yeah. Ooh, okay. Mm -hmm. Wow. I'm so surprised because I was just like, oh my gosh, they, you know, they're a big channel that's been out there. I did I not know, know. y'all was just before me. Uh -huh. That was amazing. Uh -huh. Okay. 
So um, where did you start dumpster diving first? When you first started, where did you start doing it? Was Very it first one was Petco, right, Petco? Because we didn't find nothing there. And we said, you guys are lying. You liars, you don't find nothing. Like, oh my God, we didn't find anything. At Petco, at, it was just, a, it was a little strip mall. So it was like Petco and Michael's and stuff like that. We didn't find anything that whole day. And we were like, you guys are lying. Because we, we used to watch <laughs> dumpster diving videos before and everyone would find so much stuff. So we're like, okay, we're going to test out this theory and see if it's true. We right. didn't find anything. The first two times we went out, we found nothing. We're like, you guys are lying. This is some bull crap. Like, and then they're like, just try it again, try it again. And the very first thing we ever found was at Petco. Yeah, it was. And it was a big old Kong, like one of those really big oh. like Kongs for your dog. Yeah. So we were so excited. And from then on, it was like, <laughs> We have a dumpster diving channel. Like, <laughs> yeah. Awesome. Guys, welcome into the chat. I'm glad you're all here. Make sure you're hitting that thumbs up. I was literally thinking of you, Cynthia, and you popped up. Oh, Sarah. <laughs> There's another Sarah in there. Um, okay. So now y'all used to um, dumpster dive at like rich neighborhoods. What made y'all decide to go into doing that? We still do that. Um mm -hmm. We like it better, actually. I feel that's like yeah. we find the best. I don't even know what we just why we did it. We were just like, let's just go. I, I think don't we know. went to the colleges. What happened, Craig? Maybe um, I think we went to the colleges over here. We have so many colleges around us. Oh. So many. So we went around here, and then the neighborhoods. I don't remember because we started. There's apartments everywhere. I don't even remember the first thing we found at the apartment either. I do. We we hit the biggest score ever. We hit like all. Tell us. We have a video on it, but all like those, um, the jewelry and the shoes and the calculator, the T96. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. And okay, all yeah. the like windows. Like, we made, that was a good one. That was, that was a so good, good eBay, eBay score. Yeah. That, that one, that, I don't know. Yeah. We don't know how we got into it, but we were, we just did it. And ever since then, we're like, yeah. Yeah, residential is the way to go. <laughs> I've seen um, one of the videos that y'all had got uh, Louis Vuitton and a Kurt, uh, coach coin purse. Oh yeah, that was at the college. Actually, no, 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 that was at the apartments by my mom's. It was. Yeah, the actual. See, she'll remember that stuff. <laughs> <laughs> she always remembers everything. I'm like, oh. We just found the Louis Vuitton bag at the college. Oh, okay, that's the, what I was thinking of. Was yeah, the bag. it was just the bag, but no, just yeah, empty bag. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, let's see. When you start getting a lot of awesome hauls, where did y'all wind up putting all that? Or where did you start putting it away? Because I know that happens with dumpster divers. We start collecting a lot of stuff. Go ahead. <laughs> Y'all <Yo, laughs> go No, I'm just kidding. Um, no, it's, it's... Well, no, e we started on eBay. That's when we first started selling was yeah. eBay. And then we got sick of eBay and their fees and all this crap. So we just started Mercari. selling on like Amazon and Macari and Poshmark. And then then we just did like garage sales and stuff which we still do now, but, and we still sell on everything but eBay. And we're still collecting. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So do you think that um, y'all will be able this summer to do any yard sales? We want to, well, she loves doing it. I'm like, okay, you go ahead and put all, do all the work and then I'll come <laughs> later. I mean, if people, if people are still wanting to go to yard sales, like, I don't, I, I feel like it's going to be really different. Like once, I mean, we're open in California, but who knows if people are still going to want to go to yard sales or even have yard sales. So, I mean, if people will still come, I'll do it. <laughs> I love yard sales. I know around here they have started having garage sales. So oh, okay. we haven't seen any. Mm -mm. Yeah. Well, y'all just now open. Y'all hadn't been open that long, huh? No, just Sorry, this week or a couple of days ago, they opened. And some stores like our Ross and TJ Maxx, they're not open yet. Like just, there's just slowly yeah. stores that are open. So, right. Ours is still, and we've been open, I think now almost a month and we still have places that's not, they have not opened. So uh, yeah, I don't like that. Yeah. Hmm. Let me make sure I'm not missing anything in the chat. Hello. Welcome in. Let's see. Do you know what happened to I think they called the curry fam? Oh, they're not. I don't know what happened to them. Dumpster diving girl. <laughs> um, yeah. Um, I will go to yard sales. Patricia says she'll go to yard sales. <laughs> I know. I think a lot of people will still go to. 
Hey, Pauline, how are you? They will still go to those. I'm I'm waiting for estate sales to open back know, up because we're on a we're on a I love estate sales, but yeah, mission. Now, when you go to estate sales, can you video when you're there? Or you can't. We can. We just are always it's like hard. It's hard. Awkward when it comes. We're like, who's gonna video? I'm like, it's just hard for us to like actually slow down and show like make a video about because we're just like you like to get in and get out type thing and it's just like we don't want to be asked like what are you doing like it's just right. awkward we you know? even got freaking glasses for um like recording for whatever and but then our button or whatever we couldn't figure out which one was recording which one was pic taking pictures and then we come back and get all excited like at the storage units too and then it wouldn't be filmed because we wouldn't push the right freaking button <laughs> <laughs> so i wore the glasses all day but it didn't work <laughs> Oh, oh, that's cool. Um, let's see. Have you ever rented a storage for your uh, right now? Yeah. No. Uh, yeah, but not when we were doing dumpster diving. Yeah. We bought in storage units before, but not. Right. We haven't written one since we started diving, which I want to, but. So basically, we got one when we moved out and we had an apartment and we had all of our stuff from our apartment into that storage unit, but that was it. That's the only time we had one. Yeah. Not for all this crap. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Speaking of the storage, there was a time when y'all seemed to be going into like the storage auction type thing. Um, how, how did that go? How did y'all feel about that? You know, no. you, also, I want to know, did you lose or gain subscribers or viewers that were like, you know, <laughs> go okay. ahead. Go ahead. So she doesn't like them. You can tell them why you don't like them. I, I liked them, but it was a lot of work, especially when this one likes to bid on um, units that she didn't see had a refrigerator and a couch. Excuse me. You didn't and see a love seat. And those of you that watch us know we have a Camaro. So, <laughs> so yeah, we got the unit for $1, but we had to rent a U-Haul to be able to get all that stuff out. And like, so we, it's just a lot, a lot of, lot of work. Like, so I digress. <laughs> <laughs> but and we you did had to clean it up, right? Huh? You had to clean it all up, right? Yeah, you only get like, uh, how long do they give you? It's like, like three days. Three days or something to like clean it up. But that's a lot of work. It, a whole like apartment in one storage unit for we, two people to we clean We ended up taking it from the, we took our, we got the U-Haul and we got as much as we could in there, couches, everything. And we drove it to the freaking Goodwill. It was right on that corner. Just mm -hmm. didn't, had him taken it out. He's like, what the hell? Like, the hell's all this stuff? Like, they're literally getting rid of everything. Then we came back and we had to get another load and another load. And then by the time, the end of the day, we spent money on that. We spent so much money. We basically lost money. Then we brought the rest home because it was like closed or something. We went to a different Salvation Army. They said, we can't take all that stuff. So then we're like, what the hell? So we came home. So we put a Facebook, we put a Facebook thing. It was yeah. like, it was like this really nice doll house and like some, I don't know, furniture. And we're like free. Whoever wants it. We literally within one hour, everything was gone. We had these people like they were all about it. Like we were just like, come get it. And they, yeah. they took it off our hands, so that was cool. <laughs> so do y'all still keep in touch with the channels that y'all, I know that y'all all got together. One Sorry, time. our dogs are barking. Hold on one second. Yes, knock it off. Um, yeah, so we did a big collab in San Francisco, or, uh, San Francisco? Yeah, San Francisco, California last year with like um, treasure hunting with Jeebus. He, he used to dumpster dive and like some other big um, auction. The hell, yeah. yeah, big auction. Um, and we actually gained like 4,000 subscribers just from that collab. So collabs are really worth <laughs> it. I feel like, I yeah. think they are. Like, they are worth it. Like collabs where you actually go out and meet people, not just on YouTube. Because any yeah. big YouTuber can shout you out, but that's not going to gain, you're not going to no. get any subs from that. I feel like you have to actually go out and like meet with people and like do yeah. stuff. So that was a lot of fun. Um, we were there for a day. We were only there for a day because... Of personal stuff that came up, we had to come back home. But still, we it, I thought it was a lot of fun. <laughs> but yeah, we still talked to almost every, all of them that we that we went out to see. <laughs> Do y'all see that happening again in the future? Uh, They've talked about probably it. not. They've talked about it. 
Yeah, they have. Well, just because we don't have, we don't really do. St you know what though? We only did like one storage unit when they t when they hit us up to go meet with them. We don't even know how they found That's us. True. That's like, what I was trying to say about the storage unit thing was we don't even know why they found us and how they contacted us and they wanted us to be part of it when we did like one store. I don't even remember if we did a storage unit. We did. We had we just one. To, uh, we just wanted to start doing them so that we knew <laughs> what was going on, like how to do them. Right. So when we went yeah. out there, we could be like not newbies, but we have no idea. We just found us. I mean, we're glad they found us, but they yeah. found us. I'm like, okay. Oh, <laughs> we did take them dumpster diving, so it wasn't a whole like just that storage cool. unit. We actually took all of them out dumpster diving, yeah. and they found so much stuff that they they were like, "Oh my god, this is so awesome!" Like mm -hmm. they found we found some good stuff. Is with she them. yelling or is it just me? Is she yelling? No, she sounds she's good with me. Okay. <laughs> I, can, I can hear. Her. Wow. Um, <laughs> I, I thought that was neat because I watched when, when y'all had that with them and I was like, yes, they're showing the other side and it wasn't just about, you know, the storage unit that y'all actually showed them how to dumpster dive. Mm -hmm. and I bet that was cool. And then, of course, it was like a whole group of y'all. I was like, golly, y'all live at the dumpster. That was cool. That was fun. Yeah, that was cool to dumpster dive with Jeebus. Like, yeah. he, when they were the dumpster divers, but then he didn't even want to go dumpster diving. They're like, oh, I see how it is. Okay. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Like, I'm not getting in there. Mm -hmm. I could she's so brave. She's getting in there. I'm like, well, you what'd you do before? Like, uh -huh. <laughs> right. Okay. So let me see. Um, what is the best score that you got from dumpster diving? And what's the best score from the storage that you got? You can go first. Oh my god. We we'll always say okay, I see the laptop for the dumpster, the laptop that we found. There's a laptop we found, the, the screen was dark, so you couldn't read it or nothing. We're like, what the hell? Like, it turned on and stuff. Sarah ended up, like, putting a flashlight to it, like this, and seeing it, and being able to get to the settings to fix it, so that it all worked. It was a $200 laptop we ended up selling. Wow. That was nice. And then storage unit, I think all the tools, I found a buttload of tools in the storage unit that I have in the garage right now, which helps me every day. Because <laughs> I would need something. <laughs> so, yeah. And that's what I'm doing. That is awesome. Okay. So what made y'all decide to meet up with Steven and Steph? Okay. So we were, this was before we started our channel. We were, um, I don't even they know how we, they were resellers and we just found them on YouTube and they actually told us that they were going to via trading, which is like a, um, pallet, like a, you can buy pallets, like a liquidation company. They had like a, uh, uh what is it called? Like a, partnership with them and they're like hey we're gonna go out to via trading it's kind of by your house like we'd love for you guys to come out um since you guys sell on ebay maybe this is something you want to do so that's when we first met them we went out and met them at via trading and then the second time we were dared to we were dared to show up at like their carol. yeah there's this um girl named carol she dumpster dives and she said that she dared us to show up at steven steph's garage sale like in the disguise. next day, like that next yeah, morning. Yeah, it was like the next day they were going to have like their garage sale and she dared us. So we drove two hours out there. I had like this big old floppy hat on. She had a motorcycle helmet on and we totally like crashed their garage <laughs> sale. It was the funniest thing. Like, oh my God, it was the best. That was fun. Yeah, that was fun. Steph almost killed me when she found me in their in their van. I hid in their van. I got in the she van. had broken into their van, their Sprinter <laughs> van, and was like hiding in there. Well, Steph went there to find something, and all of a sudden sees Jackie with her helmet on. Had no idea was ready to like. Yeah, that's funny. That was fun. That was good. <laughs> oh my gosh! So they they kind of advertise when they have their sales, their garage sale. I mean, their yard sales. That's yeah. How they they do. Do. I guess I don't know. It was just like we had this tight little group of people for reselling. Like it was all about reselling. So it was Carol is the main reason why all of us started in dumpster diving. Because Carol was out dumpster diving. We're like, what the hell is that? Me and Steph were like, what is she doing? Like this is nuts. And we saw her doing it. And we're like, holy crap, that's a lot of stuff you can get for free. She's like, yeah, I do it all the time. And she kept deleting her videos. Like she just pulled them up and then delete them. Mm -hmm. So then finally we went out and then we dumpstered over. We found it and then Steph goes out and she dumpstered over and then she found a buttload of stuff and we're like. Oh, this is fun. And then we all we all got into dumpster diving. Oh. <laughs> that is cool. I was wondering how y'all connected up with them. I know I first met them um through Tanya's channel with the reselling and stuff. Yep. And so I would go and I don't it had nothing to do with dumpster diving, but 
Mm -hmm. I picked up on that channel and I was like, oh, so that's how I kind of knew them from being watching them in the chats and stuff. So I was yeah, nice. when we met them, they weren't even dumpster diving. No. We were we were starting and they hadn't even no. They were just yeah. doing liquidation pallets. So yeah. That's how yeah. I met them. Uh, I mean seeing them from the reselling part. Yeah. Okay. So uh, my question is, and this is probably a personal question, but I just want to, not personal to y'all, but personal to me. Um, <laughs> what made y'all choose me to be one to shout out? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I just it's saw your, you. It's your personality. Yeah. You're just like, yeah. you could just tell real people like from not real people, I guess. I don't know. That's true. You, you like your voice, it's something about your voice that always makes me smile. I don't know if yeah. you, when you say like your girl's doing this and your girl's doing that, like that's my favorite. I love when you say that. And I'm like, oh my god, it's like I don't know. It's just <laughs> I <laughs> well, she's from Texas, she's not in Alabama. Maybe it's the accent. <laughs> you just seem so like real and like down to like or I don't know, you just seem like a real person. Like I can reach out and hug you. Like <laughs> <laughs> Not a lot of people on YouTube. I feel like I could do that too. But like, that's true. That's now true. I can't. Six feet deep. Well, now I can't. Yeah. But I can high five you. <laughs> right. Right. <laughs> um. So another question with that, because I mean, I don't know what people uh, know what y'all call me, but what do y'all call me? It's Mama girl. girl. <laughs> <laughs> Which is awesome. I feel like when you give like nicknames or stuff to people, that's when you really care about them. Yeah, yeah, that's true. I think you're the only one that has that a nickname at all, actually. That's weird. I think she is, huh? Yeah, yeah. I, I think she started that. I, it's I did. Dark, huh? she I did start. I was that. like, "Who's Mama Girl?" She's like, <laughs> <laughs> she's like, "It's Cynthia." I was like, "What? What? Okay." <laughs> like, I, I, well, know. I know you're called a Nanny Girl, you know. So your yeah. name. So when you said Mama Girl to me, I was like, "Oh, that is so sweet." Yeah, yeah. That's true. That has to be, you know. Yeah close to her and I'm just like oh they love me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. Um so let's see. Oh, Susan, shut your mouth. Shut your mouth, shut your mouth Susan. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. What's going on? Oh goodness. You got some people that know you in here, Jackie. <laughs> no, a few names because she's being funny. Like, <laughs> <I call her. laughs> okay. Um <laughs> let's see. Mm -mm -mm. I'm trying to see which question I want to ask you next. Um, y'all have helped with, um, oh, I want to tell y'all how y'all helped me out when I first started um, getting monetized. And uh, I was putting like one ad at the beginning of my videos. And I remember y'all saying, you need to put more ads in the videos because I was like, no, oh, it's just one ad and stuff. And he was like, no, could you? And I think it was one I had like 1,700 views or something. And, and y'all was like, that's why you need more ads. No, no, no. That was me, actually. That's actually weird that she I said yell that at her because for ads. she hates that. I yell at her for putting ads. Like, I'm like, don't put your ads. But then you, it was different because I'm like, she's not going to make any money. She needs to make some money. Right. And I appreciate you doing that because I didn't know, you know, and then as you know, the views start going up, I was like, oh, that's how. And and a lot of times people don't know the ins and out of YouTube, you know, and so I definitely appreciate y'all doing that and telling me about, you know, how to, to do those things. So. Oh, yeah. <laughs> OK. Um, let me get to the next page. I got I got a whole book for y'all now. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> okay. Um, who were some of the channels that you watched before you started dumpster diving? Before dumpster diving. Yeah. Before dumpster diving, like not dumpster diving channels. Mm -mm. Dumpster diving channels, oh. but um, was it any that you watched before or kind of got pointers from to kind of I mean, I know you said the lady that was, she was dumpster diving, y'all kind of caught on. Yeah. That's Barney Shopping. Her name's Barney Shopping. I don't remember. I know, I know Mom the eBay or we started watching her way back. She was way back. And what else did she do? Something, something happened with her. I don't remember what, but her, and then maybe, well, freaking Google is like a normal. No, but that wasn't before. 
Yeah. You know what? Before we were we were just watching like reselling channels because that's what we were wanted to do. We were just reselling like sure. in the garage at first, and then all of a sudden we saw Carol's video that, and then we went out, and then we started the channel, and then we started watching channels. So we didn't really like. I didn't really, like I really. I'm sure we probably YouTube dumpster diving channels, but I we mean, didn't even watch them though. Shell bells was that her name? Oh yeah, yeah. Shabli's, 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 and then that one um, at Alta. Was that the Alta? Yeah, one? yeah. Alta chick. Okay. I don't think she does it anymore. She doesn't. It. it was um, her, and her girlfriend. And then um, that other girl, um, what's her name? Um, the one that you're talking about, Lily and Kay. Yeah. We started watching Lily. Oh, yeah. Um, but we never went to Alta, so I don't really know. I don't mean, we didn't. We didn't go to Alta because yeah. I didn't want to go to Alta. So she would never go to Alta. <laughs> <laughs> and then obviously we were watching Steve and Steph, and then. Oh. I don't know. Then we and then people like then you guys started coming. Like then you came out and then like um, uh, my kind of beautiful came out. We were watching her um, and then like just every we watch everyone now. You should see we have like three hundred <laughs> three hundred <laughs> subs on our channel like that we watch like that we get notifications for when they come out. Like uh, I think Chris we and had Holly, to yeah we had to take off people because we weren't getting notified for anything. Like Steve yeah. said nothing and we have our bell rung on everybody. It's like we weren't getting notified, so we had to go and unsub and unsub and unsub because we're like, okay, who's, who's worth it? And then oh yeah, Breath Kiss, we watch her now. Right. So was there any channels that came up at the same time with you that are not doing dumpster diving now that you can remember? Or because I know it was some that when I first started, we was kind of like neck and neck on, you know, coming up. And then they just like disappeared. Like That's what happens a lot. Um, I think, oh, I was going to say we're the same with um, Fortune Finders. We're like the same. I feel like we're the same with them at the same know. time. I don't know. Our memories aren't that great. We don't have that great. Oh, come on, you are young. <laughs> I'm like 59 <laughs> in cat years. Just barely 59, right? <laughs> I think. Um, I was going to say. Dumpster diving stilettos, I've heard. The only thing. one that I can know that I know that came up like with us was um, was Ryan from uh, My Kind of Beautiful, but she's still dumpster diving. So true. That's true. That's like we both came out like around the same time. That's true. Um, the only one that I can think of. Oh, and then um, and obviously, and Duh, we came up together with them. Well, Steve and Steph. That doesn't yeah. count, though. Yeah, that doesn't count. They're on a <laughs> level of their own. Um, and obviously, we were watching like Recycle Dude, but he was more into like scrapping. True. Oh, and um, right. Mr. Scrappity came out. That's true. Um, a little bit after hey, us, see? but he's Come still on. going. But, but they're all still going. Yeah, but they're all still going. So I don't know. <laughs> so. Guys, welcome to the chat and all the ones that's in here. Yes, I used to watch Dumpster Diving with Stilettos, too. Oh, yes, yes. <laughs> um, so make sure that y'all are hitting the thumbs up in here. If you haven't shouted it out, guys, let people know that I have the Treasure Hustles on here. So post it on your social medias. If you have a channel, go post it on your community link to let people know. Um, okay. Let's see. What would you do different um, when you started your channel? Channel, What would you have done different? Anything or you would have done the same thing? Um, probably filmed better. Our That's filming, true. our earlier videos are... <laughs> what? what do you mean? I get motion sickness watching our older, our older <laughs> videos. What do you mean? <laughs> She's getting motion sickness right now. Thinking about it. <laughs> were you were you videotaping Jackie? Yeah. I oh. to, it's not my fault. I had to hold it. We've come a long way from how we used to have we used to have to dumpster dive while holding a tripod with a phone in one hand, getting it. Now the GoPro is so like for her, it just is so much easier because it Yeah, she has a new GoPro. I know we saw your video. Yeah, that's I I love it, guys. I have been practicing with it. I have been doing a lot of videos coming up because I've been enjoying it. Yeah. It's it's so wonderful having that um, stabilized, you know, just, oh, it's nice. Did you, <laughs> I, um, I you haven't tried to go live, have you, on it? No. Well, I didn't know, because um, I know live, you can go live on for Facebook, but not on YouTube yet. That's so what cool. it, that's what it is now. They actually sold it to like we wanted it because you could go live with it on YouTube. And now since they did the four thousand watch hours and 
whatever yeah. that whole thing happened, they actually did something to the algorithm. So now YouTube won't work on there. So now we got it for no reason. Now it makes me mad. No, we did not get it for no reason. Well, you know we I mean. got it because it makes so much better you know videos. I mean. But it kind of it was sucks that because that was like a, a selling point too was being able to go live with it. But because then I could just go jump into the freaking thing. No. Right. But I mean, it's still good because you can be hands free. So oh. you don't have to worry about holding it, and that that is a good thing when you don't have to hold it. Yeah. Um. So. What would you say to new dumpster diving channels, um, kind of the do's and the don'ts of, of having a channel? Well, we do whatever we do. <laughs> <laughs> Don't learn from no, our channel. Look at our channel. Um, <laughs> I'd say, okay, I, I know one. I always tell people if they're like scared to start or don't really know where to start, start at apartment dumpsters because you can just pretend like you're going to throw something away. Like if you live there, no one really knows, especially if it's in a big complex, like just take a little trash bag with you and like go inside the dumpster and peek in. And if you see something, then you can grab it. But if not, you're just throwing something away and walking back to your apartment. You know, like I always say, that's probably the easiest place to start is start at Dip the apartment. Right yeah. There. I think so too. That's a good one. I think so too. That was good. And then um, if you're going to do it at night, have a friend. Yeah. Or maybe have a whistle or something because it's scary that at night. It is so scary. It, it is. I started, I tried to start back dumpster diving at night just to kind of check out the GoPro and, you know, and stuff. Man, because I haven't done it in over a year, it was so scary. You're on the phone, right? You're with Angie, I think. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. I had her, I was like, you way over there in South Carolina. If <laughs> yeah, but I had somebody there and she was like, well, if they would have got in the car, I'd be like, get out of Cynthia's car. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but uh, it is, I would say to have somebody with you. Because when yeah. we started, we used to do it Overnight. at like two o'clock in the morning was like the time we would go out. It was like one in the morning till like 3.30. We were always like, was like nobody's awake. The yeah. world is silent. No, it's not like that's not when anyone's like. So that was that's probably what I would do different if we started again. Do but do day. it during the day, just because it's it's not that scary during the day. It's really not. It's Most really of the not. time they just think you're you either of work there or you're just yeah. I don't know, hanging out in a dumpster. Or you're crazy and they don't want to touch you. <laughs> yeah, or talk to you. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, best time right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, let me see. Um, so. For people that are watching on here and never heard of Treasure Hustlers, I don't know where they might have been, but can you tell us about your channel? What does your channel consist of? Sorry, that she's talking about um uh, what's her name? Uh he's uh, talking about um uh, King Care, what's her name? Not um not Nicole State, the other one that we liked. Oh uh, I can't remember her name. But Kayla. Uh, yeah, it was Kayla, but I don't remember her yeah sorry okay. anyways so our channel is dumps well we wanted our channel to be about everything but because we started dumpster diving we have we're kind of stuck <laughs> doing dumpster diving so our channel is mainly dumpster diving with some estate sales and storage units thrown in mm -hmm. we're not basically. really stuck because actually in the beginning we were all over the place mm -hmm. really I put my family in it. I put Nate and Paul in it. Well, we, st we we throw our family at the end of our dumpster diving videos now. So it's like if people want to stay for the end to watch it, then you'll get like family videos. If not, then the dumpster yeah. diving. I noticed at times y'all were putting in, if you want to see just this part, this is mm -hmm. the time stamp to come in there on yeah. that. I yeah. know one of the things that um, Mom the eBay are talked about is she wished that she had more variety when she started hers and not just stuck on that because that happens a lot with channels um that when you start something that's all you've known for and right. they don't want to see anything else and when you try to put up other videos you see the numbers just like right that was our problem like when we did an estate sale people they bad. didn't want to see it mm -hmm. like our our numbers so it's like why are we gonna waste five hours of editing when no one even wants to watch this video like yeah. it just doesn't make sense right so what is your average watch time on a video like nine minutes that's pretty good <laughs> if we do a long video but then she wants everybody to have short videos so if we do a 10 minute video then nine minute watch time is not nine minutes <laughs> <laughs> it's like a 10 minute because so our averaging out is about nine minutes 
but that's like a 29 minute video. If it's 10 right. minutes, then it's like a four minute. So it's like, it's both the same. It's like 60%, right? Not 60%. It's 40% of the video gets yeah. watched. Well, I know for me, it's, it's around about six to seven minutes. <laughs> and you think about it all the time and, you know, people sit there and you okay. edit it and you're going through all this and you're trying to make this video. And um, so what would you say to people that make like 15 to 30 minute videos? I actually like, I'd rather have longer videos because then it looks like, hey, it's a longer, it looks better, I think. And I think YouTube likes it more when it's longer. Like it's just, you're keeping people on the platform for a longer amount of time. Mm -hmm. And then Sarah's like, no, we want to do short ones. I think because people's attention spans are so much, or so shorter. If you can make a shorter video and then be suggested in the next one and have it auto played to another one of your videos, that's two right. videos in the time frame of a one 20 minute video. Like you're still keeping people on the platform. And I think YouTube, screw YouTube and their algorithm. Sorry, I'm saying it, but I don't think it matters what kind of tags you use, what thumbnail you use, who's in your video. Like it's either going to get out to the masses or it's not so so do it how you want to do it like i, I don't know I, that's just how i see it right i think a lot of times because i started making shorter videos and of course you get on your algorithm it's showing all these down arrows and right. watching it less i'm like duh because it's a shorter video but their attention span is staying there longer to watch more of this video you took time to make that's true. Yeah, that's like one. I made a one. I made a video. It was like what five minutes long or something about what what or not even five minutes. It was less than that. But how to get your deleted videos back from YouTube, and mm -hmm. it got like two thousand views within like a day or two. But it kept saying our numbers were down because yeah. of the watch time was mm -hmm. way way down because it was only a three minute video, and like it yeah. makes it look like it's bad. But in reality, there was a lot of people that watched that video for almost the whole amount of time because it was three minutes. Like right, uh, that's like, true. Yeah, I feel the same way. It's it's just like you can't win for losing either. You see that, and I know at one time they were talking about changing that down arrow to take that off of there. And I, mm -hmm. it, I, I that's why I stopped making videos. Like I literally was like, I don't. Yeah. You can hide it. you can hide it like in your settings, like so it's not there at all. Like your what? ups and downs, your thumbs. No, no, no. She's the, talking about when you go on your. Are you talking channel? about the thumbs up no. or the thumbs down? Mm -mm. I'm talking about when they have the, when you go on your uh, analytics. Oh, you see the thumbs down on there. Hard to say you yeah. have thirty thousand less than watched the last. <laughs> you know, yeah, I hate that. That's why I was like, I quit. I'm done. And I threw in the towel. I said, I'm not editing no more. Yeah. So let's just go live. I love that you put in clips and stuff, and that was like the first time I seen people do that on videos mm -hmm. where. You would add the clips into there. So what made you think of doing that? I actually have no idea because that's what Sarah said too. Where the hell did you, why are you putting clips in there? And then I put too many and she's like, this is way too much. So just bring it back. And I was like, but it's funny. I don't, I don't know. It, but that's how like in our daily life, like if something we say we something it, that like reminds us of a video, like we'll just like say the part in the video out loud. True. Like, or a song, like if she says something and it clicks a lyric, I'll start singing that song. Like we just do it in our everyday lives. So I think that's why it like triggered something in my mind. Like she brain. said like butthole or something in a video. So she went and found a clip that said like butthole or something. <laughs> like so we put it in our videos. Like uh, it was in the beginning, we, we used to, we were the only ones it that did fun. it. Yeah. And then she got a little too crazy and it was like every other, <laughs> like too good. much, so but good. we still do it like every okay. once in a while it's funny sometimes we but then i funny. get over it and then i tell her to do it and then she won't do it <laughs> <laughs> so where do you see your youtube channel in the next two years oh my god hundred thousand subscribers it better be Ooh, <laughs> we're almost at 15 for the last five months i know we're trying to get to 15. we haven't even got the 15 we've been at 14 for five months <laughs> so how do how do you keep encouraged? Because this is a question I need to know also. Um, how do you keep encouraged when you see uh, like newer channels and they just like fly by you and you're like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> they fly by you and you're like, what the hell? I don't, that don't make, what the? <laughs> uh, we cuss up a storm in private. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I don't it's hard. It's just like, what the heck? What are, like, I don't, what are I mean, wrong? good on them. Like, 
but it's just like yeah. like some but of their what titles. Do you know? What do you know that we don't know? I don't think they know anything. So I, I just think know. like you tell me. We just think YouTube hates us. Like that's true. In general, from day one, YouTube just didn't like our, us. That's that's what we, no, <laughs> we say. That's like, not true. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know wondering that because I know that you know, and I think what it is is because they have learned from watching, you know, like our channels and different ones, and they didn't figure out. Okay, you do this, you don't do that, you know, because when you first start, you don't have anything to kind of follow after mm -hmm. to see how do I need to, you know, that's true. Different parts, so I think they're learning from that and being able to go faster. I remember writing you because I'm like, what the? And I wrote you, I'm like, how are you doing? What do you know? What's going on there, my girl? You know something we don't know. I know. And you're like, I don't know. I have no idea. I'm like, everybody doesn't know. know. Nobody it, knows. It was the weirdest thing because I know that, um, and of course, it's always a video that you don't plan on going viral or nothing. And I know I went from having 3K to 8K, and I was like, what is going on? I mean, every time I would click on there, the, like the numbers was just yeah. like, what happened? What <laughs> you know? Like I want, I want to know what that is so I can do it again. Right. I'm gonna duplicate that. We had some videos like that, like they're they're up to like forty thousand, like, and we're like, but we didn't gain that many subscribers, so yeah. I'm talking about her subscribers went from three to eight. Are yeah. you talking about? Oh, yeah. yeah. Within a month, and I was like. Yeah, what did I do and it just happened. I don't know if you know YouTube have this certain you know I don't know how did it work, but it it seemed to happen. I've noticed with other channels where it's just like one video and they get all these views and their subscribers just come up like I, like it. I know that I know that consistency. Oh my god, on YouTube because that's the only time we were getting a bunch of views and we were getting subscribers and we were getting in suggested was. Freaking, it was like a video after a video after a video. Like we were freaking posting, and it was like really good, like thumbnail and everything. Because our thumbnails always suck. They just suck. But we had good thumbnails and good, like it was one after another after another. And then everybody was like, "Hey, you're in my suggested." I'm like, "We're in suggested? Like what the hell?" Mm -hmm. And it's like once we know that we're in them, then all of a sudden we like pull back. Like, oh no, we don't want to. We don't want to do this. But no, we can't do this. That's exactly what happened. And then all of a sudden we're like, "Doo." Mm -hmm. And we lost it. We should have kept going, but we lost it. It's yeah. a lot of work to do. Yeah, it well, like I, mean, I think it really has to do with endurance because you know we have watched channels. You know, I don't, I didn't see big, huge channels where they're doing amazing, and then it just all of a sudden they just disappear or just. Mm -hmm. I'm like, wow. I mean, having lots of people, you know, as subscribers, and and they just disappear. Oh. So, I, I think endurance uh, for the long run, as long as YouTube is going, just keep pushing on. Yeah. That's There's also like parts too, like throughout the year, like summer sometimes is so hot that like you can't even put your arm. Cute. Oh, so cute. Cute. <laughs> thank you so much for the super chat. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Hey, Sam, how are you? Hey, Cindy. Y'all welcome in. If you haven't hit that thumbs up, please do. Hey, Rosina, how are you? The trust, the, the treasure hustlers in the house. Yes, yes, yes. That's <laughs> so cute. Yeah. So I, I really think endurance is going to be key. And um, do you think it's going to change um, after all this? Ha you know, kind of gets. I, it's never going to be normal again, but. You know, do you think that um, dumpster diving is going to kind of get pushed to a higher standard or how do y'all feel about? I know because that happened. Like people were hating on us when we were out there dumpster diving. When we first, like it was, it was still this was happening. So mm -hmm. when we went out live, like Sarah was like, I can't do this anymore. Because everybody was like, this is ridiculous. You should not be out there. And blah, blah, blah. Yeah, we got a lot of hate for dumpster diving during the pandemic, even though it was like super late at night. Nobody was out. No, like it. Like I, I feel like it's gonna get more of a bad rap because people are gonna be like, you don't know what's on it. You yeah, you don't know what was on there. They could have just thrown that away because the store has been shut down because they have like a virus outbreak. Or I don't know. I feel like people might, but 
they say hate is good for the algorithm, so maybe it'll be a good thing for us. <laughs> right? Well, I know that um, this this is my take on it, and I know everybody doesn't believe the same, but this stuff was around in December. You know, oh, it was yeah. already here, and everybody was in the dumpster. Like, right. <laughs> you know, everybody was in there. Nobody was, I mean, some people were wearing gloves, but most people were just like, it's a free yeah. fall. We're getting all this Christmas stuff and everything. And then that happened and it's like, oh, I can't, I can't be at the dumpster. Oh my goodness. And I'm like, I oh, think it's in there. I, I have a video. I see you on a video. What are you talking about? <laughs> I think our immune systems are so strong that anybody in the dumpster dive should be totally fine. You should not get sick. Right. If we don't have tetanus by now, we <laughs> I've been cut. I've I been, have my tetanus shot, so I'm good on there. I've been <laughs> cut. I've been I go and get mine every couple of years. I go and get one. They're like, why? I'm like, because I don't survive. I'm, <laughs> gonna, I'm sure I'm going to get cut out there. <laughs> I'll just use my foot. It might be better for us, like with the companies, then they might not want this, their stuff back. They might just say throw it away, like instead of having, you know, some companies like in California, they have destroyed. to send. They have to like send their stuff back to like the people, like their the company that makes it. Yeah. So maybe they'll just be like, don't worry about sending it back. Just throw it away, and then it'll be new. Like, I mean, we find new stuff sometimes, but yeah. like, after, like more often we might find. That's a good, good job. Thank you, Big B, for the super chat. Thank you, thank yeah. you. <laughs> yeah. So uh, I think they'll start throwing out more stuff. So, you know. I know right now is a lot of stores that are, you know, like you said, are not open yet. Some still have like Easter stuff in their windows of the storage. You're like, oh, you can throw that stuff out, you know? Yeah. yeah. That was like our Alta was completely boarded up. They took these big old, like, what are they called? Four by four? Like, no, they're called plywood. Plywood. <laughs> they, they, I thought someone broke in and smashed all their windows, but they like legit boarded up all because of the expensive like perfume and makeup that's in their store they yeah. boarded the whole thing this for the last two months it's been completely boarded so. and they just took it down so i'm thinking they're going to start opening again but tell them i just moved in right there yeah and then around the corner we just got a huge amazon uh warehouse they no. just i mean i don't there's security up the wazoo over there so i'm sure i don't know if we can even get in but i'm sure I'm they so throw excited. stuff away i'm so excited so do, they have a dump, oh. do they have a dumpster or a compactor oh we don't know yet because they just finished building it but they were like oh my wonder what's going to be there what's going to be there it's supposed to be open house all of a sudden on the windows they put like a amazon associates only or something and i'm like what and we drive by and you see all these prime the prime band bands. Band bands i was like oh, oh my god. god and then um grandpa's like oh you should get a job <sighs> Ah, oh, that's not why I told you. I wasn't telling you that to tell me the job. We went through that anyways. Gotcha. So, what is one of the stores that y'all really like to dumpster dive at? Like retail stores. Hers is Ulta. Why are you pretending to think? Mine is Five uh, Below. Well, I like Five Below. Five Below always sends out the good stuff. Always. But I like um, I like Bed Bath and Beyond. When they forget the lock in the Bath and Beyond, or mm -hmm. if I accidentally fall through the top of the Bath and Beyond's dumpster, <laughs> that has the best stuff. Now, uh, do they spray paint stuff there or no? They do. So how do yep. you get it out? What did we have that we kept? A we did we kept a comforter. It was like a Tommy Hilfiger did brand new. Out? Oh no, they just sprayed the outside of it. Yeah, That's they why. sprayed the outside of it. The they didn't even bother Stupid. spraying the actual yeah. comforter. comforter. And then my um, dog, our dog, um, stairs that we have in our bedroom. Oh yeah, I don't know how the how the spray paint got off, but maybe from the dogs running up and down it so much. It just comes. It just comes right off. Like came off. Yeah. Um, I don't know what else we haven't. I don't know what else we found. We got a blender there, but I think we threw it away because I think I was missing something. Mm -hmm. yeah, grandma girl was a big thing, but yeah. So Sarah, you don't mind doing those soup bags when you find those? She don't give a shit as long as she finds something. We haven't found any soup bags. It's either like they're in there or it's not. Like so, like I'll make her That's jump true. in because was the dumpster smells bomb. I don't care what you say. Go inside an Ulta dumpster and it smells good. So I make her jump in and like. <laughs> So usually the ones by our house, like the, it'll just be sitting there um, 
or like they don't do soup bags or they don't do boxes or like we'll find a hair dryer sitting like on the side like on the side or something or yeah, it's we, like we haven't really found one time we did and i think it's, it was a personal dump like someone actually because it, it was remember all that stuff at my mom's house you spread it all out that one day oh yeah but i think that lady or she's stealing stuff one or the other maybe but she i don't know a purse we had like a purse with all of it in there yeah it was a purse like just stuffed with like mm -hmm. Nail polish it's and weird like, shit though. It's yeah, like, it was like, like random stuff, but it was a good. It was so, a good like, thing. of that, have y'all ever uh, went to dumpster dive at a retail place and you can tell that maybe the employee stashed something back there? Yeah, we just said lot. that. Where was it? Um, what did we just score? Oh, five below. Remember? We thought oh, that we know for a fact that she's doing it because our security guard told us. Yeah, our security guard told us that the new yeah. supervisor over at Five Below was like her husband lost his job and like it was right before Christmas and so she's been she's been putting it and I was wondering because there was a car back there I'm like what the hell is this car doing but I was still over there but it was her car sitting there waiting for her to come out the back and then put it into her car. So one yes. day one day we were there and we got it right as the people like dumped everything in the dumpster and that we was, pulled up. That was before we knew. About yeah it. this was before <laughs> we knew because then we felt bad we're like yeah. crap like if yeah. it's really for her family like we kind of. I mean, it was like a boys it was like a boys pair of headphones a girls pair of headphones a boys pair of headphones. like everything was in doubles or triples or whatever but it was always a boys and a girls because that's for kids I guess which had boy and a girl so had well, most retail places they don't supposed to be I know yeah. right we still felt bad after the right. fact but we got the score that she was gonna take take and it was like but brand new that, everything so much stuff it was headphones Mickey Mouse headphones we still have the Mickey's in Right now yeah that was a big then, score yeah but then yeah then he told us and then we felt bad and then everybody in the comments was like who does this shit? she's not supposed to be doing she's that stealing, <laughs> la, la, la. like we're like okay but then we didn't go back <laughs> <laughs> so uh one of the things that you kind of brought up how did y'all wind up being friends with the security i know it's like more than one right that y'all are friends well, or well, no? yeah she, <laughs> like, no. he gave her the numbers she told the other security guard, "Oh, she'll date you if you let. Like, we'll give you give him your number." So, she, like, what, what was, it was like really late at night, and we were scared he was gonna like. He yeah, said, he "Well, was give her, give me your weird. number, and I'll let you guys dive." So they gave him my number, and he was like texting me and stuff. I was like, oh, yeah, it was weird. Yeah, it was funny. But he let us dive, so I'm like, take him for the team, whatever. So we just haven't gone back there in a while. Yeah. But then the other guy, we I don't even know how we were. I think we were just dumpster diving, and Chuck, his name is Chuck. He just comes around. Was supposed to say his name. Oh, his name's not Chuck. His name is something else. <laughs> and, and I'm sure we said it in a lot of the videos. Anyway. Yeah, yeah. We always forget his name. I don't know. Um, and he was just like, uh, "Oh, there's nothing in Alta, and there's nothing in Five Below, but like, there's some stuff in um, Aldi's." Like, and we're like, "Oh, okay." He's like, "If you go over there, can you get me like those yeah. carrots or something yeah. like that?" And so ever since then, like, if he sees something he wants, that we obviously. Aren't gonna take. We just and he likes talking. He needs somebody to talk to. He needs a friend. It was just him and his wife at home, and then his little granddaughter comes over. So he likes to talk about his granddaughter and what right. stuff he gets for her. And then his son also, his granddaughter's son, passed away. And like so, every time we see him, he just has something. Like he just wants to talk about something. So I'm always like, okay. And I'm all talking. And Sarah's like, get her out of here. Oh. And we're like live, and everybody's like, dude, you're talking too much. Get up. You guys need to get out of there. <laughs> so now I have one more question. Uh, Cause it's almost at our hour time, which thank y'all guys for sticking with us. If you haven't hit that thumbs up, please do, and make sure y'all share it out that the treasure hustlers are in the house. But um, so the the question is, when y'all had the police officers, when you had your cam your um, GoPro on, and you had the police officers stop y'all, and like the camera would cut off or whatever. Um, how was that? How did you feel about that? And did y'all get more subscribers after the end? <laughs> no, we didn't because it took it down from YouTube. That was scary as shit. Well, normally when we get stopped by the cops, they're usually really nice, nice and they just say, we, we're just make sure you guys have your phone and you're careful. We get stopped by the cops all the time. Like, it's not yeah. a big thing. We're not that scared. But this last time when we were live streaming and they legit, like, pulled up on us, like, 4D pulled up on us with, like, the spotlight and was like, get down here walk slowly like i was like we're was we're, we're going to jail that's it we're arrested like it's over like and we were live streaming and all of a sudden 
as the cop was coming up to us, the stream, YouTube took it yeah. down. Someone like, and so everyone was like, everyone was freaked out. Like, why okay. are you guys arrested? Let me go. Okay, go ahead. Okay. So we were in the, I was in the dumpster. It was a very big dumpster and it was at Target. And I, there was a big pile of everything. And I was trying to stand up and get over the thing. And Sarah's already gone. And she's like, oh yeah, the cops are here. And she's freaking gone by the car already. And I'm like, well, help me. I'm starting to freak out. I can't get out. I'm like putting over, I could not get up. And the guy's like, get out. I'm like, I can't. And I just like threw myself over with one arm. I don't know how. And he jumped down, like broke my ankles, both of them. <laughs> sort of walked back and I'm like, it's just a camera. Don't worry. Like, please don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. And Sarah's like already up there and he's like, walk all the way to me. And we go all the way to him. And then he's had to sit down and then he's going over to the grandpa's car, like looking in there and looking around for somebody else. And he's like, who else is in here? And we're like, nobody. Then all of a sudden, whoo, like this girl jammed and she pulled up. I'm like, oh, there's a girl. She's ready to search us. That's why they brought a girl. Mm -hmm. and then the car comes. I'm like, holy crap. Now we have a guy standing behind us from the pitch black. They're like questioning us. Well, why are you guys here? What are you guys doing? We're just dumpster diving. There's some stuff already in the car. Check. He's like, like, we're we're diving for treasure. Yeah. I'm like, like, what do you do this for? Yeah, I'm like, we're diving for treasure. <laughs> <laughs> well, what do you guys look for? Treasure. <laughs> Have y'all ever used your YouTube to kind of get out of trouble? I like, think this one did. This one, I swear, because did. we were live. We told him we were live. And yeah, we said we we're live. I was like, we got like 47 people watching or something. We're live and. She's like, okay, and then it was fine. And the next thing I know, I looked down at the camera and it's black. I'm like, oh my God, it turned off. And I said, oh, well, I oh, I guess it cut off. And then I'm like, shit, I shouldn't have said that out loud. Now they know that it's off. But I don't think they heard her because they're, cause they were like, at, at the very end, after they gave us like our IDs back in my purse, cause he like, he's like, can I, he do I have car. permission to get I your purse? Shot. I almost got shot. She did. She, Cause she was like, um, she, they're like, where's your IDs? And I was like, mine's in the car. And she's like, mine's in the car. I'll go get it. And so Jackie gets up to go over there and they're like, ma'am, sit down. And Jackie's not listening. They're like, ma'am, ma'am. And I was like, oh my God, that's it. I was like, like, I get up to go get it. I'm like, well, I was taught that you're not supposed to just let the cops go into your car. <laughs> you're trying to be like the first amendment auditors. Like, I'm like, you're not supposed to let you guys go in my car. So I can get it for you if you want. And they're like, no, you need to sit down now. I'm like, they were like yelling at her to come back. So then oh. they go in the car and they're like, do I have permission to go through your purse? And I was like, they're going to do it anyways, right? Go ahead, like go yeah. through it. So they give us our IDs. And then at the end, they're like, you make sure that the city that we were in, um, police department, where you tell your YouTube people that we were so nice to you yeah. guys and that you like, could be going to jail. You guys could be going to jail, but what happened? because of the COVID, it was yeah. right at the start of COVID. So they thought we were trying to break into Target. Like, <laughs> I was trying not to say it out loud. <laughs> it doesn't do anything. I know it doesn't. Anyways, so but yeah. Um, but they were like, you make sure you tell your YouTube that we were the nicest police department so I did. and to give us a thumbs up and to rate us. Like, so she was I trying did. to like, I did. I remember her name still, it was Fox. <laughs> she, was sexy. <laughs> she was foxy no i'm just kidding she wasn't that sexy but i went and i did raid her though i'm like oh they're so nice like i did like a little oh well i'm yeah. glad y'all were okay everybody was so worried that happened they was like oh my goodness the hustlers got arrested and it was just like <laughs> everybody that was cool we should have kept it going i thought we were, i thought we were done like, <laughs> okay, <for a> while. <laughs> I should have waited, but we went right when we got home. We went on with um, uh, Desert Hunters, right? Yeah. Well, they were live at the time, yeah, and so we're like, I popped on in there. the chat. They're like, "Oh my god, the hustlers just got arrested!" Like they were all freaking out. So I was like, "We can't tell them. Like we got to tell them." Like so I can in. see you, Maureen. You're not blocked. Sorry, Maureen keeps asking if she's blocked. No, hi. Let me see you. <laughs> But the guys were not nice at all. No, like the guys, were and then once the girls showed up, I already knew just because I know once a girl shows up, because there's girls, yeah. we're being frisked and we're going to jail. Like that's the only reason why they would have a girl come. So I already knew in my head. I was like, we're going to jail. That's it. <laughs> like, but oh and they and they did say they said if this if we weren't in the middle we're trespassing, of, but there was no signs. No, but they did say that if it wasn't um, C nineteen then you, we would be taking you guys to jail right now. But because of this, they're not having, they're, they're not like processing any new people inside the jail. So, so they're dumb. like, so we got lucky. <laughs> they guess. said, do you, do you, or they said, what are you trespassing? We're like, there's no signs that say trespassing. So no, we're not trespassing. Yeah. Like we literally looked around like, oh no. And we're like, no, look, like, come on. Just right. But yeah. 
That well, was glad y'all safe. And I appreciate y'all so much for coming on here. I hope people have learned a lot more about y'all. <laughs> and if y'all have not checked out Treasure Hustlers, these are my girls. And you know, I say, if, you know, if I bring somebody on here, somebody that y'all definitely need to go and check out. Make sure that you tell them Diving With Purpose sent you over there um, and show them some love. Cause you know, like I said, they showed me love from the beginning and I would only like to do back to them what they done for me. So I appreciate y'all. Love y'all so much for being on here. I'm gonna end the chat, but y'all stay on here where I can speak to y'all a few minutes, okay? Okay. All y'all, thank you for being on. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Have a good night. <laughs> That was a